Big changes coming to the Muskegon County Airport. Renderings of the renovations and the new flight service that's being added this summer. Um, what, what we're doing is primarily is driven by a leaky roof. That's what prompted a $2.9 million grants funded project aiming to make Muskegon County a better place for air travel. We're, we're trying to market this not only for as a destination for the community of Muskegon, but also as to the general aviation community. Here's what it will ultimately look like. Part of that effort is updating the terminal, which last had work done in 1994. Replacing skylights, adding decorative lighting. Yes, the renovations cost a lot of money, but Ken Efting says, in the end, it will save. We're expecting it to reduce our heating and cooling costs by about 40%. On top of curbing costs, flight cancellations at the airport have needed to be curbed too. Southern Airways Express came in and they've struggled mightily in the environment uh, here in West Michigan. That's why a new carrier is being added. Recently the, the county board um, announced their support of Denver Air Connection's proposal. Denver Air Connection, a regional flight service, will be a big part of the airport's new facelift. Their cancellation rate is less than 1%. Which is well above the industry average, well above the average of any airport in Michigan. Approval from the Department of Transportation is imminent, airport officials say. Meantime, Muskegon hopes to attract more travelers very soon. Once approved by the Department of Transportation, flights by Denver Air Connection should be flying out as soon as August. The renovations should be complete by fall of this year. Reporting in Muskegon, Jack Crone, Fox 17 News.